Both the Roland GR55 and VG99 offer extensive capabilities to add expressive control through MIDI continuous controllers. Almost any parameter can be controlled remotely via MIDI and the user can specify the control range, the polarity, and dial in the exact musical effects they want to achieve. This video clip steps through a few examples of MIDI control using the Ibanez IMG 2010 guitar and the GM70 Turbo with the GR55. I'm using the IMG 2010 since it offers more control possibilities than any other guitar synth controller ever made, but the principles are the same with any MIDI controller, such as the Roland FC300. First, let's look at Factory Patch Rhythm 31-1, Dreaming Resonator. I use the additional controls on the IMG 2010 to control the guitar level, delay level, and to select between bass, banjo, and resonator models. The effect I like the most is assigning the virtual whammy bar on the IMG 2010 to bend the pitch of the guitar model up and down four semitones. The beauty of this is the PCM tones are not affected. This way by playing a simple open fifth, A and E, then bending the guitar down four semitones, the combined sound is now a major seventh chord. The GR55 or VG99 allow the same parameter to be controlled by different MIDI controllers with different value ranges. For example, using factory patch lead 9-3 poly distortion, the virtual whammy bar bends the pitch up or down two semitones, the range typical for melodic pitch bends. At the same time, the first control knob, CV1, is assigned to bend the pitch by one full octave for more dramatic effects. A basic brass patch really springs to life by assigning a controller to tone level. Lead 20-1 French horn is modified by assigning the virtual whammy bar to PCM tone level. You can now use the virtual whammy bar to add breath control. This is different from the default use of the GR55 control pedal, which is assigned to patch level. By controlling the PCM tone level, you keep the ambience of the reverb. For fans of the vintage Roland GR300, the original controls can be recreated using the IMG 2010 guitar and the GM70 Turbo. Filter cutoff, resonance, and LFO depth are all controlled by the guitar. In addition, a Roland EV5 is used with the GM70 Turbo to control the LFO rate. The final example is the patch 5-2 Rhythm. Strat plus Tweed to add variety to the repeat of the main theme used in my performance video clip. The 12 string effect is enabled on the D and G string only, pitched two semitones up, and activated using a foot switch with a GM70. This enables a guitar player to reproduce the kind of close harmonies associated with keyboards rather than guitars. <laughs> 